Star Child Mentoring Program. Hi, mamas, papas, guardians. Thank you, thank you so much for being here. So, is your little one, you know, very sensitive or um, do you find that they have experiences that maybe you you maybe you do understand they're like i'm not sure how to guide them or you're like i don't know what they're talking about but they clearly can see certain things or they tend to be you know um maybe they take on a lot of energy and it can be overwhelming for them um and you're interested in how we can help them out right uh this is the place to be so our our littles um the younger generation they are all coming into this world so open and so bright without a lot of the um, kind of walls and uh, um, barriers that uh, many of our generations and, and beyond um, came in with um, that were breaking through. These little ones are coming in wide open and a lot of grown-ups are going, what do I do? <laughs> so if your little one seems to be interested in crystals or really connected to the earth, or maybe they see things, maybe, they, um, maybe they're very emotional when they connect with the tree, or perhaps they're always looking up into the stars and like really feeling pulled to go out there and having a hard time being down here in the 3D realm, you know, um, that's all very normal. It's very, very normal. Um, maybe they are connecting with uh, grandma who, they may have never actually met in this lifetime because grandma passed before they were born um, and they have messages, right? All these things, um, again, very normal. So if they were to come and join in the Star Child Mentoring Program, it is offered every other weekend, um, every other Friday and Saturday. It's a two day session. So on Fridays, me and your your little one uh, will connect on Zoom for 15 minutes just to check in, see how things are going, how is school, what are they going through, how are they feeling, um, and talk about what they want to do for their Reiki session the following day, which will be on a Saturday. During that time, we'll talk about you know how they can set up their space. It's a very private time for them. They will not be on Zoom with me. They can be out in the backyard. Um, I don't know, planting or uh, stacking rocks, or, you know, they can be inside, you know, building blocks or doing puzzles, coloring. Um, they might be napping. They might just want to sit quietly. They might want to sit with their crystals. Um, you know, there's so many things they can do. I recommend, highly recommend not being on the screen. This is all about time for them to just be alone and in their own space and connecting with their beautiful highest frequencies, right? Um, they can spend the time, um, you know, uh, yeah, just reading. They can read, they can journal, depending on how old they are, whatever they might, whatever might be good to them. Um, this could be right around nap time if they're still doing naps, though mm, they might be a little older for that. Um, but I still take naps, so there's that when I can. Anyways, so we'll talk about that, right? me and your little one will talk about what is it that they want to um, release from their energy for the next week or two that are coming up what is it that they want to bring in whether that's more confidence or um you know finding ways to have for, more fun during recess so as we connect with that after um, our zoom chat uh by that by the evening the friday evening i ask of you to please send me an email with everything that is actually going on um, everything that you want to do uh, want to address regarding what you feel maybe they're going through maybe they're having trouble at school perhaps they're having trouble sleeping uh, or maybe they're they're having a lot of temper things or you know they're having tr trouble processing um, their emotions or whatever it may be right uh, I ask that you just give me whatever information you feel would be beneficial for their session the next day and what you would love to have me help assist them with clearing out and also calling in. And then the next day we'll meet Saturday, um, the immediate next day. And uh, for the first 30 minutes, I will be texting you at 20 minutes before our session begins with the music that I will be using during their Reiki healing session. And then if you can, um, 
if they're interested, go ahead and play that music in the background for them while they're doing whatever it is that they're doing, just so we can be in the same frequency. You don't have to, if they don't want it, that's totally fine too. Maybe they have their own music. Maybe they wanna have their own dance party. That's absolutely okay as well. Um, and then, so the, during the 30 minute uh, Reiki session, they'll be doing their thing. At my end, I will be doing their clearing. I will be doing any activations that they're ready for at this time. I will be opening them up. I'll be aligning their chakras rewiring their um, internal energy <laughs> um, and uh, clearing out any blocks or any stiffness um, and then of course incorporating everything that they, sh they shared with me as well as whatever you shared with me um, speaking with their higher selves if maybe they are having a harder time with specific things in the 3d realm talking to them saying how can we help assist the little one um, uh, into their 3d existence right how do we um yeah how do we assist them in what can be a very heavy energetic world for such an open pure little vessel and then at the same time i will be pulling two cards for them um just to get some extra information as well as channeling information for them on um you know maybe what their gifts are or maybe what they're going through right now um what next steps are, good ways to clear, good ways to shield, good ways to ground, whether it, whatever spirit wants to share. Um, <laughs> I think a, a little squirrel just jumped off a tree. <laughs> um, very playful. So that information will come through. And then I will pull a few cards for you, for the guardian, um, just for any kind of guidance and assistance on how you can be there for your little one. Um, during this time of existence, right? Um, and then, so then at the end of our 30 minutes, we will have a five minute break. Uh, I will be texting you the pictures as well as the crystals that we used um, in case they want to start adding to their crystal collection. A lot of kids are really discovering crystals now, which is very exciting to see. Um, so, you'll receive all of that. Um, then after a five minute break, you will have received a Zoom link as well. So the last 25 minutes I will be spending with your little one on Zoom and we'll be talking about what their experience was like, what information I got um, from my end. I'll show them their cards, talk to them a little bit about that. Um, and then we will wrap it up. If 25 minutes is too long for your little one, that's totally fine. Whatever leftover time there is, if they're like, I just wanna talk for five, <laughs> that's fine too. And I could spend the rest of the time if you'd like talking with you and letting you know how things went. I will record each Zoom conversation and you will receive that because they are minors and that's for you to be able to watch. You don't have to be in the room with them during Zoom unless you wanna be, it's up to you, it's up to them, whatever's most comfortable. If you feel like they'll open up more, um, if they're on their own, that's great too. Um, and then af at the end of our two days together, I will be emailing you a full recap on what's been going on, um, what I saw, and uh, and yeah, you'll get the crystals and, and, and all that fun stuff. So whole lot comes in with the kids. So that is offered every other weekend. I would love, love, love to connect with your little one. Spaces are very limited though, because it is, um, offered you know not as often um and i do have clients that love to do every other week just because it keeps the ball rolling and it keeps the momentum going and the kids they really do um enjoy connecting because they get to talk about things that maybe the other kids might look at them funny about so or they come in with new experiences and things like that so okay enough talking from me i hope you have a wonderful day uh, if this is something you're interested in, please, please, please feel free to contact me. You can book your session below and I look forward to meeting you and your little one. Sending you all of my love. Have a beautiful rest of your day. Bye.